What up YouTube, this your boy down low back for another reply. This one is to Freddie Gibbs featuring Kurt Cobain. Bout it, bout it. And you know what? This track is I man. I mean, what I like about it is it's different from the music that Freddie Gibbs been dropping as of recently. But overall, man, I know Gibbs can do much better than this. Now, first of all, Kurt Cobain's ruins the fucking track. I mean, that auto-tune shit was played out before it came the fuck back out. And then it's pretty fucking terrible, man. Like, you are much better off getting an actual fucking singer instead of being a cheap ass getting auto-tune on your fucking voice. But the main thing I want to talk about, man, is the fact that people try to classify what exactly is a hit with gangster rap music or any type of music. When you begin to try to break shit down and create a formula in order to follow to make a street hit or some shit, you're defeating the entire fucking purpose. See, there are no rules to this fucking music game. Just because those Lex Luger beats get a whole lot of shine on some gangster rap shit doesn't mean that's the route to take. I mean, it worked out for the first few people to do that shit, but once everyone started to do it, it diluted the potency of these types of tracks. And the thing that I seen with Giz, man, he was doing a whole bunch of those types of songs, man, basically just fitting in with what everyone else was doing instead of doing what the fuck he does best, and that's being him. See, gangster music can be defined as just rapping about some gangster shit. How you get to rapping on the gangster shit is all on you. That's how the game can constantly evolve and constantly get better. Because there's no set formula, no guidelines to follow. You just do it the best that you can possibly do in a unique way that's true to you. But anyway, on to today's article, man. And today's article is about knowledge, discipline, and creativity. I get a bunch of questions, man, all the time. And like, one of them is always... What do I have to do to get into this music industry? And that is not a simple question. People don't know that there's no exact answer to this shit. But there are basic principles that you can follow to do better at it. The first principle is expand your fucking knowledge. And when I say this, that doesn't mean go to World Star Hip Hop and watch fucking videos and shit. No. Read a fucking book. But the main things you need to focus on to get your knowledge right is reading and getting your experiences right. Now, but all the knowledge in the fucking world isn't going to help you in this game if you're not disciplined enough to grind and promote every fucking day. The thing about life, when you're doing shit right, man, this shit is boring than a motherfucker. And lastly, being creative, man, because... You can have all of the knowledge and discipline in the world. That'll take you pretty far. But if you're not creative enough to create your own fucking path, then you will be doing that shit for fucking years making no headway. 